It's on now? Okay. All right. We're just about at showtime here, so we'll get started. Uh, ooh, that's no good. I'll stay back here. <laughs> Walk around the other way. Uh, welcome, everyone. My name is Tom Jordans. I'm with Saskatchewan Cattlemen's Association. Welcome to uh, Agribition 2018 and our You Gotta Beef With Me Chef's Challenge. Today, going head to head in our Chef's Challenge, we have Mr. Tom Wood from Luther College uh, Cafeteria and Christine Gafanko. It was a hard name to pronounce, so I uh, had, to, had to get a prompting there. Uh, and they're gonna go head to head. They get uh, 45 minutes to cook. They're gonna choose a cut of beef each They've got to create four dishes for us. Uh, three of them are going to be tested by our, uh, our panel of chefs, judges, and then one is a display piece. So um, we want to thank the uh, Regina Culinary Federation and uh, John from Crave's, uh, Crave Bar and Grill. Kitchen and, kitchen and wine bar. Um, and so chefs, you get to uh, pick your, your uh, main protein here. Here are four cuts of beef, as selected by our uh, chef from the uh, Canadian Beef Center of Excellence in Calgary, Alberta. 100% Canadian beef here. They get a choice of top sirloin, ribeye, T-bone, or ground beef, ground uh, chuck. So chef, you chose the uh, ribeye grilling steak, and chef, you chose the uh, top sirloin Medallion steaks. All right, chefs, now we have our black box here. So we got, we're throwing a little twist at them. We've got some uh, secret ingredients that they have to use. Uh, what's inside here? There's some radish shoots. Ginger. Sunchokes, sorry. Uh, we looks like there's Saskatoon's in there. We got some radishes, red pepper, Mustard seed, oh, quinoa, there we go. And from our good friends at Bia Kitchen Hero Spices, we've got the Jamaican bobsled bob sled spice. Uh, Bia Kitchen Hero will be on later in the week, uh, giving us a presentation. I think that's about it. Chefs, have at it. Before they can start cooking, they have to create their menus for us. While they're working on that, we'll go over here, we'll meet our judges. I'll try not to uh, get some feedback going on. And from Victoria's Tavern, we have Chef Kelsey, who is our uh, chef judge. Right here, this uh, big beefy guy beside me here, Mr. Garrett Hill. He's one of our uh, Saskatchewan Cattlemen's Association directors. And from Real Ag Radio, Jessica. So thank you very much uh, to our chefs. Uh, chefs, do you have a menu yet? Still working away. Looks like we've got some big, bright, smiling faces. I understand uh, the people in the audience, most of you are from Yorkton. Sacred, Sacred Heart. Heart. Very good. Uh, I hear Mrs. Parnetta is a very, very nice teacher. She paid me to do, to say that. Yes. yes. Right, guys. I'm a good teacher, right? Uh, yeah. Do Do you guys know Mrs. Parnetta's husband, Jeff? Yeah. So Jeff and I are very good friends. And do you guys know that Mrs. Parnetta is a uh, she enters smoking competitions? Yeah. Do you know that Mrs. Parnetta beat her husband in a smoking competition? Right here. And Drake was on the team. And Drake was on the team, so there you go. So any chance you get, you got to congratulate Mrs. Parnetta on uh, on winning that. So she's a very good cook. I've eaten her food many times. Our first turn in here from uh, Chef Tom Wood. He's uh, going to do some seasoned grilled. Uh, Sirloin medallions, roasted potatoes, radish sprout salad with quinoa and roasted asparagus. 
And Chef Christine, oh, a classic steak and eggs. Nice first thing in the morning, a steak and eggs grand slam. Pan fried ribeye served with Saskatoon berry, quinoa, pan, oh, and Saskatoon, ah, served with quinoa pancakes and Saskatoon berries. That's a nice one. Uh, using the Jamaican jerk roasted rub and uh, some sun choke hollandaise sauce. Very nice looking menu there. So our chefs will be scored uh, out of 100 points, possible 100 points. Uh, the judges will be looking at their treatment of the beef today. Uh, do, they, uh, do they cook it well? Do they look after it? Uh, the use of the black box ingredients, so those secret ingredients in the, uh, in the box, they didn't know ahead of time what they were getting. Their originality, the use of the ingredients, uh, and a bit of originality there. Their plating design, and then their kitchen skills and, and cleanliness around the kitchen. So uh, keep an eye out for that uh, as, as they're, uh, they're cooking. Chef, Chef Tom went to work right away pan frying his uh, sirloin medallions. He's got them going, seasoned them up a little bit. Over at the other, uh, we got our quinoa going. Got our quinoa started and we're uh, cleaning some of the parts.
about it. And our judges are doing a little look around to make sure our chefs are on task here. Part of the scoring while they're doing that, uh, I'm over here with uh, Chef John. And uh, Chef, just tell me uh, how you came up with your black box ingredients, why you put them in, that type of thing. I think so. So what are sun chokes? I've never had a sun choke. Oh, cool. And quinoa, another uh, Saskatchewan crop. Tell me a little bit about quinoa. 